My name is Anouk Wiprechts. I am a fashion tech designer. That means that I do fun stuff with electronics on the body. I have been working with Arduino for about 16 years. In the beginning of 2000s, computers were really, really big. So my designs often looked really nice from the, from the front, but in the back there was this really, really big beast of a computer. When I discovered uh, Arduino, it was for me the perfect way to uh, downsize some of the bigger uh, components and things that I was using, especially big computers. So really downsizing it into a really small, a small form factor that was really easy to program. I think the coolest thing about Arduino is that it makes uh, working with electronics really fun. It is something that you can easily work with it, um, especially when it came out. The big thing was like, yeah, derivative, being a derivative of C++ programming, which is a hard uh, coding language to learn. So easy access and, and being able to do things in a really easy way. That's definitely something that um, I think Arduino is really good at. And yeah, for prototyping, therefore, it's, it's just a really great tool to use. The boards that I use myself are the Arduino Uno, uh, for prototyping. Also, when I give courses, I do workshops or I, give, uh, I teach. I would use an Arduino Uno because it's just really easy to like plug and play kind of. Arduino Uno board is pretty like legendary and it has been the same over time. And that is kind of nice because you always work with kind of the same form factor. Yet other things uh, went up like processing power and all of that stuff, of course, all the good stuff that you, that you want. What I really like and what I now am using are these um, Arduino Nano ESP32. Super, super small. Uh, they're easy to uh, like put into garments or fabrics or whatsoever. And um, also like with that, uh, you can like connect to your design, right? Whatever you have. Uh, for example, the dress that I have here next to me is a collaboration with Chromatic 3D. And it is also having yeah, one of the Arduinos in there. And uh, it is basically a dress with a proximity sensor. When you step into the personal space, LEDs on the dress start to light up. So both the proximity sensor as also the LEDs are connected to uh, one of these. These are all examples of uh, yeah, what happens when you put technology on the body and let it interact with either yourself body signals or the world around you sort of you know um, and and that is my yeah biggest passion to make weird stuff around the body almost and uh, that brings me a lot of joy